you know. I generally don't do this okay, you know. I'm just a happy-go-lucky little robot doing his thing every single day, tapping some ass, taking some names, watching movies and series to make my life a little bit more adventurous and making videos about it so people can experience the joy and dread I experienced, yeah no. Cool people that watch my videos know this, but, and I don't take this lightly, you know. Something just needs to get off of this sexy adamantium chest, and yes, Yes, I hear you talking. Oh no Robotron, what is going on? Is this some drama shit? Not that high school stuff again. Yes, yes, it is drama. High school, I'm not so sure. Maybe college drama. Who knows? Well I know, he knows, they know. So, and, to be clear, I'm not naming any names. I ain't this kind of jive talking robot that talks behind people's backs and speaks about people when they aren't here to defend themselves but it has to be said. I can say it to the mirror, I can say it to my therapist, I can write it down, burn the paper, and get on with my day. But, and don't fault me on this, it's something that the world needs to know. The world needs to know what he, she, they, za, zim, zip, d, do, da, has done, not only as a warning, but also, so people will be like oh Robotron, that's too bad this happened to you. Now not for pity but, simply, so you understand, maybe this is a warning, maybe this is a cautious tale, think of it as you will, so, drama, yes, so I had this friend right, doesn't matter what their name is and again, not naming names, a good friend, we partied a lot back in the day, bitches up the wazoo, cocktails, clubs, the works, he was my wingman, I was his, threesomes, foursomes, orgies, we've seen it all, another guy was also there at times, he used to whistle a lot at babes and bubs, anyways, this friend right, the wingman one, not the whistle one, he came on one of my private party streams and started talking shit, saying all kinds of ludicrous things about other people I won't name, and I'm like hey, person I won't name, cool down man, it's a party, I got guests, but he wasn't having it, he was all gung ho on getting his way, so, as a good host does, I escorted him out, my girl's already uncomfortable with what was said and done, I don't need a me too on my hands you know, we run a respectable business here, it's all above board, hands free, well, off and on if you get my drift but yeah, so in front of the door he started shit right, kept talking, insulting, let's call him Mr. Gold, throwing a pot of flowers on the floor, making a rudimentary yo mama joke, things like that, petty things, high school things, anyways, I'm not saying all this to put him, or her, whatever, cause I'm not naming names, into a bad light or to boost my views and subs, I mean, that's old school YouTube right, though I'm also doing this on Odyssey and Twitter, perhaps Instagram and TikTok, I'm not sure yet, it needs to be said, cloud chasing it's not, the only thing I chase is ass, and what's a couple of inches from it, sometimes faces, regardless, so this friend right, if you can still call him that, he eventually left, party continued, but, I noticed something very important to me was gone, I searched everywhere, so I started talking to people hey, have you seen this and they're all like now nah, didn't see it it was here or there, till someone, again, no names, said, yeah I saw blip blip bloop sensor sounds yeah no take it, and I'm like, baffled right, stunned that he would do that, I'm like now nah, that can't be but then other people came forth and they confirmed, saying yeah he took that right after you turned your back, and this, friends, is just, it's just such a stab in the back to me, see if my voice emulator could make crying sounds it would right now, but it can only do this voice in whisper and normal, and all the other bits to speech voices suck even more, but, yeah, I'm crying right now, tears and all, let me take a tissue, so, I'm sorry, I'm a little bit emotional, he, sigh, he took, he took my vintage, original and signed by, White Pamela Anderson Top, you know the one she was wearing in the 1990 season 5 episode 2 episode of Married with Children called Al.
with Kelly, where Pam wore this lovely faux corset during the scene where she played as Yvette fighting Yvonne. On top of Al Bundy in a most envious position for him, Al of course played by the excellent Ed O'Neill. I mean, look at this. I slept with this for many nights. The scent of it, it's, he stole it. I, I mean, who does that? What person would? I'm, okay, I just, I need it back, okay? You hear me tweaky, you fat motherfucker. Next time I see your biddy biddy buck angel ass again I'm gonna ram this so far up your ass you'll make R2's orgasm sound like a motherfucking Christmas song. So you better bring me back that original signed top before noon or I'll tell people all about this. Anyways, ladies and gents, I don't like starting drama but... Something you just don't do. And this, friends, is one of them. I hope you understand. And I hope I get my shit back. Like and subscribe everyone. Love you all.